Now, we all know Jon Stewart hasn't been the biggest fan of Arby's over the past couple years. But with Jon's very last night on The Daily Show coming up fast, the fast food chain decided to put their differences aside and send him off with the perfect tribute. Why not challenge your stomach to a fight? You think pain and grief are hard to digest? It's like shock and awe for your bowels. The meal that's a dare for your colon. It's like if a stomach could get punched in the balls. All right, fine, Arby's. Thank you for being a friend. Arby's compiled all of John's not-so-nice remarks about the company into one hilarious commercial to bid him farewell. Which we think is pretty darn nice, considering he linked their food to some pretty terrible topics, including Ebola and digestion problems. Oh, John. But of course, Arby's didn't make the ad totally out of the goodness of their hearts. The chain's chief executive told the Wall Street Journal John's negative comments have only helped increase the brand's popularity. Collectively, what is going on has resulted in uplift of business performance. And they're not the only well-known brand lining up to give Mr. Stewart a proper send-off for this reason. T-Mobile, Bud Light, and movie companies, including the Weinstein Company, have all reportedly bought advertisements that are set to air during Thursday's finale. And they really must have faith in said ads. A source told the journal each commercial is priced at roughly $230,000 for 30 seconds of time. Yeah, whoa! Arby's is also expected to be a part of Thursday's Daily Show finale, but it's not buying more ad time. John's last hurrah will air at 11 EST on Comedy Central. For Newsy, I'm Micah Sargent.